Okay ladies and gentlemen, Sprite145 back and welcome to part 2 of my life history and welcome to Nuke 248. This one is kind of cheating, but not. It's done on Ultra IWNet. But, who cares? <coughs> it's still technically Modern Warfare 2, just some of the players on IWNet or Ultra IWNet aren't the brightest. <laughs> but, this this turns into a very very depressing We've game by the, the end. I mean, my legit aim is good, but anyway, we'll carry on from where I left off around year nine. So, year nine is a yearly school trip to France, and as I said, that's where I started. Everyone started to realise that I liked someone. So. <laughs> That that was the best holiday, best best trip I've had. And around, we're going back a bit now because this school trip was at the very end of the year when you break up for summer holidays. Um, go forward in time a bit, or back in time, whatever, to around the, the half term, so around Marchish when we moving house and I ended up having a massive argument with my dad over this because A um, I didn't want to move house not to the sort of places he wanted to move because that means he wanted to move far far enough away that I wouldn't be able to um, go and go go to the same school and stuff um, I'm not a good person for change. I don't like changes. Um, I was actually happy living where we were living, all of that crap. And it was just ended up just saying words to the effect of "I'm, I'm not moving." We're, 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 my my say in the house moving was literally. I've got to be able to get to school on my bike, or you're giving me a lift every morning. And he's not big on giving me a lift, so, there. And on the actual day of us moving house, bearing in mind I'm in year 9, so this is around, um, I don't know how old I was then, year 9, must have been about 14. Yeah, about 14, I was out with one of my really old school friends. Um, and we got pitched because when I actually turned up back back at the house they they gave me a ring on my phone saying you need to come and help move some stuff and said, oh, but I'm my friends go away I did eventually come and help them but that's not the point so anyway we're in year 10 now after the summer holidays and um start your GCSE year um, and that was a very up and down year um, finally asked the girl out she said yes so had something extra to work for not only my exams had to you know keep the missus happy and I reasonably enjoyed year 10. But it wasn't the best year of my life by any stretch of the imagination. Um, my school year wasn't anything special really. Um, it was just getting the piss taken out of you having a girlfriend and all that shit. <laughs> but Come the summer holidays, that that that's when my life really really changed. Um, so two weeks in Greece, um, three weeks, three and a half weeks in total without seeing the girlfriend, um, because she went on holiday in the second week of our holiday, and we come back, and I think it's the the evening we get back. 
we get a phone call from either my gran or the hospital saying that my granddad's been taken into hospital. And that that wasn't good news because me and my granddad were incredibly close. He he loved to come and watch me play cricket. What one of the reasons I played cricket was because of him. My my dad also played cricket, but I my 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 granddad encouraged me probably a lot more than my 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 dad did. Then within the next few days, we get another phone call saying that. Granddad had died. I was fucking heartbroken. I, I remember sitting there on the sofa, um, having to explain to my littlest brother, um, who can't have been that old at the time, um, um, have to explain to him what 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 happened. I didn't know how to explain. I was 15, and I, I I did not know what 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 to say, how how to explain it, how how to make him feel better. But oh well. I remember texting my girlfriend, who was in Spain at the time, and telling her, and she actually rang me to ask if she was okay, and that that was heartwarming. Then final year of GCSE, so year 11, we had the uh, school prom and me and my girlfriend had broken up at this point. We broke up around November of year 11, so I was 16 and stuff. And we'd broken up and I was doing everything in my power to try and get, get her to go to the prom with me. And I shall finish this episode nuke 249 it's not much to go it's just year 12 and college so i hope you enjoyed that nuke sprite 145 and i'm out